um, it's like really cloudy outside and you can see the ring light like on the TV and it's just not a nice aesthetic. So, um, anyways, so hi, welcome to week four, day two. I'm gonna do a five minute warm up so you can skip that if you want. Um, but we're doing a 20 minute uh, hit workout and it's gonna be six movements three times. Um, you don't need any equipment, so let's just start this warm up. So um, I'm gonna start in a down dog. So this is just how, what I usually do when I work out at home. Um, whew, it feels so good. So you wanna bring your um, tailbone like towards the ceiling. And um, like, I like to flex one knee and then like bend the other and alternate. And like really just ease your way into it and take, remember when you exhale, your belly button comes in and up. And then when you inhale, you can feel everything, like your belly, you can feel your belly expand and fill up. So your hands are nice and sturdy, your arms are nice and sturdy, your shoulders are relaxed. And then I just lift up one leg, I point my knee towards the ceiling and then I stack my hips on top of each other. And then I just go to the other side. Hopefully we don't hit anything. Oh my God, it feels so good. Okay. Um, and then I can just come into a pigeon pose. So um, it's like basically bringing my left knee out and sitting on top of it. Um, you can feel a stretch in like your outer glute area right here. You can like lean into it. Ah, just hold it for a second. And then do the other side. Feels very good. Okay, nice. And then you can come to tabletop and just do some cat cows. So when we cat, we empty our stomach. Everything comes in, exhale. And then when we inhale, everything opens up. Ugh. Now we're standing, sorry for my noises, jeez. Okay, um, so I just sit into my left leg like I'm doing the side lunge, stretch my um, inner groin, and then I can bring my legs together about hip distance, distance apart, and then I'm gonna pivot right from my hips so I'm not like coming down, I'm not bending my back. My back is completely straight. You can bend your knees a little bit. <sighs> and then sink down. And I like to grab my opposite elbows and let my head hang. And then like on the exhale, you can kind of feel every vertebrae separate. And nod your head yes and no. Let go of your elbows if you want. Just hang in here. Oh, it feels so good. All right, very slowly, vertebrae by vertebrae, we come up to standing. Whew, drink some water. Stretch our quads. I'm grabbing my right quad. Pull it straight back. Don't let your knee come out to the side. I saw somebody on TikTok do that the other day. And I was like, Ugh! sorry. Okay, pull it straight back. Other side. If you have to grab onto something, you can grab like your, your ear. I've heard that works. If you want an extra challenge, you can come to the floor. Okay. Whew, I feel pretty stretched. Anything else that you need to stretch, maybe your side body, you can grab your hand and like pull it up to the ceiling. Ugh. Interlace your hands behind you. Pull your shoulder blades back to open up your front body. Reach out and back and down. Uh, okay. All right, I'm feeling good. That was like four minutes. Um, all right, so let's get started. The first... Okay, here we go. So the first thing we're doing is squat, and then we're gonna take two steps to the side, and then a little jump. If you're in an apartment and you can't jump, just go up to your toes. So we're doing six movements three times. And halfway done. Set. 
seven, six, five, four, three, two, and time. Okay, next we're doing up down squats. So this is when you go all the way down and then we go up a little, down a little, and then we come up. Option to jump if you want. Three, two, one. Here we go. Down, up, down. Good job, guys. seconds. Make sure your core is activated on the exhale. Two and time. Good. Okay, next we're doing um, shoulder taps. So we're just going to be in a plank up on our hands. Hands are directly underneath our shoulders and we're going to tap opposite shoulder. In five, three, two, one. So when I do these, I put my feet like wider than usual. My hands are directly underneath and I'm trying to move as little as possible. Remember on the exhale to bring everything nice and tight. Halfway done. Just focus on your form and time. Okay, now we're doing our bicycle, so we're gonna be on our backs and we're gonna do 90 degree bikes with our legs. So this is when both legs are bent at 90 degrees and we just tapping opposite elbow to knee while one leg goes to the floor. Okay, so then hold and then switch. Hold it for like a second. Remember to keep everything coming in on the exhale. Try to keep your legs at 90 degrees the whole time. I'm gonna flex my toes to the ceiling. I couldn't decide what I wanted to do with them. 10 seconds. Six. Three, two, time. Nice job. Okay, now we're doing our push-ups. I'm gonna attempt a regular push-up and then I'm gonna switch to modified. Okay. In five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. I am exhaling on the way down, which I honestly have to see. I feel like I should be exhaling on the way up. 10 seconds. Five, three, two, and 10. Okay, last thing, we're doing lunge jumps. So we can either, we can either go into a split squat here, opposite arm and leg, and just keep going down like this until I say switch. Or um, you can hop right here for 20 seconds, or you can switch legs for 40. I'm just gonna hop here, okay? So we're going, we're hopping. If you can't hop because you're in an apartment, just um, just go up and down. All right, let's switch legs here. Left leg is forward, my right arm is forward. Both arms are at 90 degrees. Little hop. Good 
job guys. Five, four, three, two, time. Okay, now we get one minute break. So the first thing that we did were those side walking squats. 40 seconds. We only have two more rounds. Okay. And we're going in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, four, three, two, one. So we're just gonna squat, one step, two step, up. Everything is engaged. I'm trying to stay as tall as I can. Halfway, more than halfway. 10 seconds, seven, four, three, two, time. Nice job. Okay, next thing we're doing are up down squats. Three, two, one. So we're going all the way down, up, down, squat. Oops. Tight quarters. And just breathe. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, time. Nice. Shoulder taps. So we're gonna come down. Okay, we only have to do this one more time after this, so that's great. Okay. Eight. We're going in five, four, three, two, one. Our feet are nice and wide. Butt is down. Try to move your hips as little as possible. Keep that core engaged. Enjoy the stillness here while we're still burning our muscles. 20. 15. 10. Five, four, three, two, time. Nice. Now we're on our backs. We're doing our 90 degree bikes. In seven seconds. Five, four, three, and here we go. Make sure your elbows are nice and wide, chin is up, head towards the ceiling. Focus on that breath, on that exhale. Everything comes in. 10, eight, five, three, and time. Okay, push-ups. And doing modified. Feel free to do regular. And we're going in seven, five, 
three, two, and here we go. Fifteen seconds. Ten. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Time. Nice. And our last movement for this round. Our lunge hops. And then we just have one more round after this, and we're done. Okay. So let's start with our left leg forward this time. Right leg back, arms are engaged, and one. Keep your back nice and tall. It's a very small movement, a nice, slow, controlled movement. We're almost done. Two, nice, and we switch. Right leg is forward, left arm is forward. Back is nice and tall. Almost done. Time. Okay, we get a one minute break. Last round. So we're going to start with our side to side um, squats, walking squats. And we'll go in 20 seconds. One. So we're squatting one step, two step up. Nice job, guys. We are on our way. Ten seconds. nice and tall. All my weight is in my heels, like I'm sitting in a chair. I might even be able to wiggle my toes. Shoulder taps. Nice job, guys. We're almost done. Seven seconds. Five, four, three, two. And we are planking. And nice and controlled movement. It's better to be controlled and slow than going really fast and your hips are going everywhere. <sighs> nice 
Nice job, guys. Just breathe here. This is the last time we're doing this. Seven seconds, five seconds, three, two, one, time. Okay, now we are doing our bicycles. So on our backs. And we'll go in five, four, three, two, one. And we're off. Pick a spot in the ceiling, keep those shoulder blades off the mat. See if you can pick up the pace here. Little tap, and then we switch. Keeping that core nice and engaged. Legs are at 90 degrees. Like a seesaw. Nice show, guys. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, time. Woohoo, okay. Push our ups. Let's do it. After this, we have one more move and we are done. And we'll go in three, two, one, okay, and go. today. And 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, time. All right. Last but not least, probably the most, lunge jumps. Or just regular lunges. And we'll go in three, two, one. So my left leg's forward, my right arm is forward, and I'm just bending and coming straight up. My back is nice and tall. My weight in my left leg isn't going into my heel. My knee isn't going forward past my toe. All right, let's switch legs. All right, left arm is forward. Five, four, three, two, time. That's it, guys. Nice job. If you want to cool down with me, stick around. Otherwise, thank you for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe and share all that fun jazz. And I'm going to cool down. So I'm just going to start my back nice and tall. Roll my shoulder blades back. Pivot at my waist. Make sure you're hydrating, too. And you know that I'm done. I'm just gonna let my hamstrings sit here for a second. Yay. Hi, sweetie. She acts like I neglect her. When I went outside today, it was 30 degrees and we ran around into snow. Yes. We did do that at seven in the morning. Okay, so that was nice. Now I'm going to open up my legs and I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to pivot forward at my hips. I'm leaning on my elbows right now. You can lie down if you want. You want to lie down? Go ahead. Okay. Is this even a stretching series or is it me and Lolo cuddling? Yeah, I think it's me and Lolo cuddling. Okay. Nice. Now I'm going to reach my right hand to my left heel and get a stretch on my right side body. Take a deep breath here and exhale. Sink a little deeper. I'm gonna come up to the other side. Reach, stretch. Feel a stretch in your side body. I know I think, I know I think. And 
back to center. Okay. All right. I like being on the floor a lot. Um, so I'm just going to go onto my back and I'm going to put my left leg over my right heel. Put my left hand in between my leg, my two legs. My right hand comes around and we're going to grab my hamstring and pull my knee towards my chest. And you should feel a stretch in your groin, hip flexor area. Sorry if I'm off the frame here. My dog took over. Hold this for like eight seconds and breathe. You can rock side to side. Wow, that felt really good. My hips were very tight. And then you're going to do the same thing on the other side. Pull that, you can use your elbow to push your right um, knee away from you as you bring this leg. Use your left knee to pull your right uh, foot towards you. Wow. Okay, nice. Good job, guys. Uh. Okay, I feel good. If you need to stretch anything else, feel free. Um, thanks for working out with me. Make sure you're hydrating and eating lots of protein. Okay, thanks for watching. Let me know what you thought and I will see you tomorrow. Oh, sorry, excuse me. <laughs>